into this head wrap tutorial. Okay, so the first thing you're gonna do before you even start your head wrap, I suggest you moisturize your hair and then let it chill for a little bit. You don't wanna moisturize it and then put stuff on your hair like immediately. So moisturize your hair, let it chill a little bit, go drink your coffee, eat your breakfast, come back, okay? Now, what you're gonna put on your hair prior to putting your wrap on is either a wig cap or a satin bonnet. At first I was using a wig cap, but then I realized it was hard for me to wear my wraps for a long period of time because my head would start hurting. So I had to let the wig cap go. We moved on to the satin bonnet. But you want the satin bonnet that has the little nice, you know, flat in, not the kind that has like the, um, like the hard, what do you call that? Elastic in it. You want it to have this little smooth band on it. Okay. So you're going to put that on and scoot it back so you, so you can see your baby hairs, right? Scoot it back so you can see your baby hairs. Like I told y'all, I didn't do too much with them. Um, what I'm going to do right now is do a little bit more. more. So I'm gonna grab a little bit of my edge stuff. I ain't trying to do too much. I wasn't gonna do this. I don't know, I just wanna do this. I was not gonna do this. Now I'm all excited and I didn't got out the edge control. I didn't even mean to get out the edge control. So just let me know if y'all want a baby hair tutorial because um, I slick been meaning to do one for a long time. Um, but yeah, this just like a little brush job. So don't base your decision on this little job I'm doing here. This is just like a little, little quick little some. Oh, and also, I don't think I did not tell y'all. I got my wraps from from Amazon. I used to be able to like link the stuff I got from Amazon. I'm a I'm gonna try to link these for y'all. Came in a four pack. I got four wraps. They come, they have different color options and schemes and all that too. So you don't have to get the pack with the color I got because they have different color options. But okay, this is enough. Like I said, it's just a rush job. We're not we're not even for real. That's that's good enough. Let me show y'all the ones that came in. Let me show y'all the ones that came in my pack. So it came with a black one. Came with this tan one. I've only wore these two so far. So those are ones that are out of the package. And it came with a navy blue one and a dark purple one. <clears throat> Haven't worn those two yet. I will do my best to link them for you guys as well. Okay, so anyways, look, I got something on this one for this to be. We're gonna start with the black wrap, okay? So this is it all stretched out. Yeah. So like I said, you put your bonnet on, you have your baby hairs out, or your wig cap, whatever you're using, and you're gonna throw it to the back. Now this is the way, I'm gonna show y'all the way that I wear my wrap the most common. I don't know how many ways I'm gonna show y'all. Uh oh, I'm a little ear cuff. Okay. So now you just throw behind your ear. You know, you kind of look like, you kind of look like a nun. Okay. Kinda, you kind of look like a nun. You go and grab it up. And it's easiest if you like take your bonnet and kind of place it at the top so it's kind of out the way. That's kind of an important step. Or you gonna grab it up when you tie it. So I mean, either way, you, you do what best for you. That's what I like to do, okay? So you're gonna put it behind your ear. Then you're gonna grab it up on the sides, making sure your bonnet is closed in. You wanna make sure your bonnet is covered in the front and in the back. So let me show y'all the back. And this is how you gonna grab it. Your bonnet is covered, make sure it's tucked in. You don't want to out with your little hairs. Can y'all see me? Yeah, get out of like this. 
Okay, I hope this is a helpful tutorial. I'm doing my best, y'all. Okay, so I'm gonna swing one edge, I mean one side to the front. <clears throat> We're gonna work on this right side. So what I do is you can twist it like this, or you can act like it's hair and kind of do like a little plait, like a little two strand twist. It's up to you. We're gonna two strand twist it. Okay, all the way down. Two strand twist it. So you run out. Okay, so we done ran out. Now I take this and I go across the top of my head, right across the top. Y'all see that? Right across the top. And then behind the ear. And I tuck it under. You can even tuck it under the bonnet or the wig cap, whatever. I just tuck it under. It's gonna be loose at first because we haven't done this side. But you tuck it. Okay, then. You move to the second side. You go two strand twist it all the way down. Do, 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 do. Or just, you know, do like this. You know, make it unique to you. Do what you like to do. Okay, and get down to the end. We're gonna take it across. Now, we're gonna take it behind this first piece. Take it behind. Now, let me show y'all. Uh-oh. Okay, yeah. Gonna take it, and we're gonna tuck it under. Okay, so both are tucked under. Both are tucked under. And you got your hair wrap on. Okay, y'all see how easy that is? Um, you could use some bobby pins to make sure it stay if you're concerned about that. You could, if you use the wig cap, it's gonna be tighter, so you could tuck it under the wig cap and you will feel more secure. I feel secure like this because, you know, I wear it like this all the time, so. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. So this is the number one way that I wear my hair wraps. It's my favorite. Um, I don't wear the other, the other ways I'm gonna show y'all, I don't wear it that often, but I'm gonna show y'all cause y'all might, might wanna mix it up. Let's go to the next. This next style, I literally just took one of the, took one of the sides down. Uh, you could just wear it like this. Look at this. You see? You could just wear it like that. So it's just one and then a side down to the side. That's a look, okay? We're to the back. I think it's more so like a to the side thing, but it's a look. I literally just took one of the sides down and undid the um the little two string sweets. This a look, okay? So we had we had two, we had two hair wrap styles so far. Let's move on to the, okay. let's go to a low bun. So we gonna keep this one on. Uh, same concept about tucking it behind your ear. Uh-oh, okay. Same concept about tucking it behind your ear. Same concept about grabbing two sides, but this time you gonna, instead of like pulling it to the front, you are gonna pull it to the back. You gonna grab it like a ponytail. You can grab it like a ponytail. It, if it's easier, you could actually take a ponytail holder, so it's easier for you. Of course, I don't have one. I literally just thought to say that I don't have a ponytail holder, so that's okay. Let me show y'all what I'm gonna do. Uh, for this, I'm gonna, I'm gonna have to really show y'all from the back. Okay. So you can make it easy and grab a ponytail holder. <clears throat> Since we don't have one, we just gonna start doing a two strand twist. And we do it. Okay? So now I'm gonna bring it to the side. We're gonna two strand twist it. 
with both sides of the scarf all the way down. All the way down. <clears throat> okay, we're gonna leave it to right here because it's getting a little weird right there. So that'll be enough. Okay, now from here, this is the low bun. We're gonna wrap it around itself. Let me show y'all. Okay. We're gonna take the two strand twist, pull it up, hold it, like put your thumb, your thumb, bring it over your thumb, and then just start wrapping it around. Yeah, here we go. See this? We're gonna start wrapping it around that one piece. All the way around. And then when you get done, just tuck it really wherever you can. There's no specific way. You can leave it tucked out. Just make sure the bonnet is tucked under. You got a low bun. Low bun. You could do the low bun to the side. You could do the low bun to the back in the middle of your head. And then just kind of come to the front. <clears throat> you see how my bunny hanging out? Just make sure you bring the wrap to the front to cover that. <clears throat> now we have a low bun. This is actually cute. I think I'm gonna start wearing this a little more often. But yeah, like I said, to make it easier, y'all can get a scrunchie. And then it's just like if you had long hair tied in a ponytail and then wrap your bun around. Same concept. Let's go top knots, right? Let's do, is that what you call it? I don't know if you call it top knot or not. Or not. Okay. I don't know if you call it top knot or not. Okay. Now, it's a couple ways you can do this. It depends if you want a big knot or a little knot. Let me show you little knot first. So, you're just going to take it, uh-oh, just like this, and... Uh, let me, let me think, what do I do? Okay, we're gonna hold our head down with this one. Yeah, yeah, that's what we do. Okay, we're gonna put it on our hair like, if we just got out the, if we just got it out of the shower and our hair is wet and we wanna put it in the towel and dry it, that's what we're gonna do. So, grab this up. And once again, I know y'all didn't caught up now. Two strand twist it, okay? That's what we doing. We got two strand twist it. This is gonna give us like a small knot on the top. I'm gonna try to see if I can remember how to give y'all a bigger knot. <clears throat> I'm just giving y'all what I got off the, off the top of my dome. I did not write anything down. You know, this was, I was intuitively brought to film this video this morning, so. Okay, we got our little ponytail. We got our ponytail in front. Mm. Is this a look? I mean, I don't know, y'all let me know. Anyways, we got our ponytail, and it's just like in the back. You just kind of start, you hold it, and then just start wrapping it around itself. Wrap it around itself so you can't wrap it no more. And when you're done, tuck it. And then like this part right here, just tuck that in. Okay? And this is a, I mean, I said a loose, loose on that. It's not really little, but you know. It could be bigger. So this is the top knot. Okay, this is the last one. 
until I come up with some more styles. Okay. So I'm gonna do this one. And for this next one, we're actually going to use another wrap to make it bigger. Okay, so we gonna fold this one all the way up to be small, right? We want it to be small because we're gonna sit it on top of our head for more, let's roll it up. Yeah, we're gonna roll it up like this. We're gonna sit it on top of our head for more volume. Is that what I'm trying to say? Somebody help me in the comments. I think it's volume. Okay. Now, I just did this for like the first time or like not the first, yeah, the first time with these wraps last week. So let's see if I remember. Um, Mm. Okay, we're gonna take it from the back again like we just got out the shower. Make sure you pull your bonnet to the top so it's not hanging out the back. You could also like put a scrunchie around this so it like stays out the way too. Okay, we're gonna put it, start it from the back like we're getting out the shower. But the difference is gonna be, we're gonna put this at the top, right? And then bring the wrap over it. Okay. Oh, I remember, I actually got help. Let's see if this is something we can do by ourselves. Oh Lord, okay. Okay, so hold it. And then what we're gonna do is, okay, there we go. Bring the wrap behind our ear. Okay. Okay. Oh, there we go. Okay. Focus on one side. Okay. We're gonna focus on this side. Okay, yeah. This side uh, behind the ear. Okay, bringing it behind the ear kind of help it stay in place. So we are gonna, I'm not too strained in this one. We just gonna twist this one. Because honey, I, I'm worried about it falling. Let's just keep it real. I'm worried about it falling. Okay, we are gonna take this to the front and around. This is what I did last time. I don't know, pull it down. Oh Lord, this might be a blooper because this ain't looking right. Okay, no, we don't want to twist it. I don't think that's right. Oh Lord, I might have to bring this one back to y'all because this is looking like, mm, she don't know what's going on. Okay, so we gonna twist it one time to kind of make it tight. And then we gonna pull it around. Pull it around and tuck. Ooh. I'm gonna have to bring this one back to y'all. This is giving, she don't know what's going on. I'm not putting this in there. Okay, twist it and just bring it over. Around. It's hook. I was trying to give y'all the like Erica by Zoo. Okay, I think I did okay. Let me show y'all the back. Y'all know how to get this one. Y'all could tell me this shot with this favorite one. This thing. Or what would be better if y'all help me out? You know, if you got a video and you know what I'm trying to do. Send me to it. Teach me so I can come back and teach the people. Okay? Don't talk mean to me. Help me. This is the community. We help each other. But honestly, I like this. I like this. So basically, we just put that other wrap up there and just 
twist it, bring it around, tuck it. Twist it, bring it around, tuck it. So this is kind of like your, your Erica Badu one, you know. You know. You know. You know. Okay, y'all. That's the last one. I don't know how many I showed y'all. It'll be in the title. Um, yeah. I hope y'all enjoyed this video. I'll see y'all in the next one.